Hi guys, it's Linda from the Meredith Library, and instead of doing my bookshelf, I'm going to do my digital movie watch list, some movies and shows that I've been watching. Um, so let's get started. Puppy's going to join along for this one. So the first movie that I've really enjoyed has been Birds of Prey. It follows Harley Quinn's journey after she breaks up with the Joker, and she teams up with an unlikely group of other women in Gotham. Uh, who form a little team that they end up calling themselves Birds of Prey. And I highly recommend it. It follows Harley Quinn's story pretty closely. I think it captures her spirit. Um, I think the Gotham that they show in the movie is the closest feeling to a real Gotham since I played the video games or saw the show Batman the Animated Series in the 90s or the original 90s movies. Um, I really think it came the closest to feeling like true Gotham, so... And it's so funny, um, I will note that it is rated R, so just keep that in mind. For TV shows, I've been loving What We Do in Shadows, and I would also recommend the movie for that one. It is so funny, it follows a fake documentary crew following a set of vampires who live in a flat together. Um, the first one, the movie, if you start with a movie, um, it's a group in New Zealand and they all live together. Uh, Taika Waititi, you might recognize. And then the show is in set, set in Staten Island and it is so funny and it just gets funnier and funnier as it goes so I would highly recommend that some of my favorite characters are Guillermo and um, the energy vampire Colin Robinson from the show um, so watch that one uh, my next animation is another show and this one's a feel-good show this is pretty good for the times um, Shit's Creek it's the name of a town and it's this rich rich family that loses all of their wealth and the only thing they have that they own still is a town that they bought because the name was funny and it's about their journey and finding themselves and finding a new home and it is hilarious so um my two real favorites are david and moira um sometimes i find myself speaking like moira at random times during the day right lily my baby now i also really like horror movies so i'm going to recommend a particular director and he's from new hampshire and it's robert eggers or the eggers brothers um they recently made a film called The Lighthouse, which is set in Maine, and it's about two men that are isolated on this island together for a very long time, and um, you kind of see them going a little crazy. It's very fascinating. There's a big Lovecraftian theme. It's black and white. It's a beautiful, really well-done film. Very good acting from both Robert Pattinson and William Dafoe. Another film by the same man, Eggers, is The Witch. And that one is set in New Hampshire in the 17th century. And it follows this family that's kind of isolated. And they kind of slowly um, fall prey to the superstitions of Puritan New England. And um, so I would watch that. 